Assalamu alaikum students. Welcome back to your English class. Before we start with today's lecture, let's recall a little bit of what we did in the last class. So in the previous class, we read a story about a man called Amin who lost his crop in a drought. Do you all remember what drought means? Yes, you're right. It means a period of no rainfall. Okay, so after that, Amin bought 12 boiled eggs from a merchant promising to pay him later and left for his journey to another village in search of work. When he returned seven years later as a rich man, the merchant came knocking on his door demanding 500 silver coins for the 12 boiled eggs which Amin refused to pay. The merchant took his complaint to the judge and on the day of the hearing, Amin came in late. The merchant told the judge that if Amin hadn't taken those 12 eggs from him seven years ago, he would have had a large flock of birds today and hence Amin should pay him 500 silver coins to make up for the loss. The judge agreed with the merchant and asked Amin why he was late to the hearing. Amin told the judge he was busy planting boiled beans in his garden. The judge called him a fool and asked him how boiled beans could grow into plants. Amin won his case by saying that just as boiled beans can't grow into plants, boiled eggs can't hatch into chicks. Now let's continue from where we left off. Please open your English Broadway books to page number 13. Look at the Learn to Read section, part 1. Pehle two questions mein aapko correct option choose karna hai by ticking it. The first question is, Amin lost his crops because A. Somebody stole them B. There was too much rain C. There was too little rain Do you all know what the correct option is? Now, in the story it says he lost all his crops in a drought. Therefore, the correct option is C. There was too little rain How many of you got it right? Good job, students. Next question. Amin left the village because A. He did not like his work. B. He wanted to look for a job. C. He did not like the place anymore. In the story, it says, He decided to look for work in another village. Therefore, the correct option is B. He wanted to look for a job. Now for the next set of questions, open your English notebooks and on a fresh page write today's date and day on top of the page. On the next line, write learn to read part 1 and leave a line and write answer the following questions. Please copy question number 3 from your English Broadway books and don't forget to write the question number. The question is, why do you think Amin bought hard-boiled eggs? Amin ne hard boiled eggs apni journey ke liye liye the taake jab raaste mein use bhook lage to wo ye ande kha le In the next line write answer put a semicolon and write he bought hard boiled eggs because they would last a few days and he could eat them during the journey Leave a line and write the next question which is 500 silver coins for 12 eggs is a lot of money why did the merchant ask for so much money अब आपको याद होगा कि जब मर्चेंट ने अपना केस कोर्ट में प्रेजेंट किया था तो उसने कहा था कि अगर वो अमीन को 12 अंडे नहीं देता तो दे वुड हैच इनटू चिक्स जो हेंस में ग्रो होती एंड दीस हेंस वुड ले मोर एग्स एंड इवेंचुअली ही वुड हैव अ लॉट ऑफ हेंस प्लीज राइट द आंसर इन द नेक्स्ट लाइन द मर्चेंट आस्क्ड फॉर 500 सिल्वर कॉइंस बिकॉज़ ही कैलकुलेटेड दैट द 12 एग्स वुड हैव हैचड इनटू बर्ड्स व्हिच इन टर्न वुड हैव लेड मोर एग्स एंड सो ऑन thus producing a huge profit in seven years. The fifth question is, did Amin plant boiled beans in his garden? Yes or no? What's the answer, students? It is, no, Amin did not plant boiled beans in his garden. The last question of this part is, question number six, how did Amin win the case? Students, recall karein ki last part of the story mein Amin ne judge ko realize karwaya tha ki boiled things can't grow into anything. So the answer is, he proved to the judge that just as boiled beans cannot grow into plants, so too, boiled eggs can produce chickens. 
And with this question, we come to the end of today's lecture. See you all next class, students. Goodbye.